Reedy opening, King's Indian attack, symmetrical defense, Smith's love variation. Giveaway one player was winning, but then gave it away. That game was pretty competitive. White played a bit better than Black in the opening. Black better navigated a chaotic middle game. The Reedy is a less common but flexible opening that controls the center with the knight before committing a pawn. The d5 and e4 squares are under the control of nf6, which advances the knight into the center. In order to dominate the center from the long diagonal, g3 is getting ready to fianchetto the light squared bishop to g2. g6 prepares to fianchetto the dark squared bishop on g7, where it will attack the center from the long diagonal. In order to gain room on the queen side, b4 gets ready to fianchetto the dark squared bishop to b2 where it will sit on the long diagonal. As a result, the bishop grows and gains flexibility on the long diagonal. By doing this, a bishop moves out of its beginning square and into the action. The bishop is prepared to grow into a functional square. That's good. This fianchettos the bishop by placing it on a powerful diagonal. It is best. A powerful play. It is quite good. This exchange is fair. It is ideal. Backs off. It is ideal. That is a logical response. It is quite good. Castling gets the king to a safer square, out of the center of the board, while also developing a rook. Castling kingside tends to be safer because the king is further from the center. Castling gets the king to a safer square, out of the center of the board, while also developing a rook. Castling to the same side of the board as the opponent avoids some of the attacking associated with opposite side castling. This develops a knight from its starting square, activating it. Game's master. It is the final book action. By growing a bishop from its initial square, this activates it. That's good. This allows the opponent to develop a piece while also winning a tempo on a bishop. It is an inaccuracy. This is a missed chance to provide a knight who is weak a defense. It is incorrect. Recaptures. It is ideal. This enables the adversary to capture a rook and gain territory. It is incorrect. This is winning stuff. That's good. Now that the rooks can see one another, they can defend one another. It is quite good. That rook earns material if it is captured. It is ideal backs off. It is ideal. While not a mistake, that is also not the wisest course of action. That's good. This wastes a chance to threaten a rook and gain the tempo. It is incorrect. What I would have advised is that. It is ideal. This displays a queen attack. It is ideal. The rooks are linked by this, making it easier for them to work together in the future. That's good. That pawn was available for free. It is quite good. That's a decent move. That's good. It is best to avoid doubling pawns because it weakens the pawn structure. This allows the opponent to challenge the opposing rook for the open file. It is a mistake. This competes for the open file with the opposing rook. It is ideal. The rook is now in a safe position. That's good. This is a missed chance to use a knight to take an outpost. It is incorrect. This reveals an impending attack on a knight. It is ideal. This shields the knight who was attacked. It is ideal. It's alright. That's good. This leads to losing a pawn. This threatens to take an outpost with a knight. It is a blunder. This misses the chance to get a more equal position. There was only one good move there. This ignores a better way to win a pawn. It is a miss. This leads to losing a rook. This missed a move that would have produced a winning advantage. This overlooks an opportunity to threaten winning a bishop. It is a blunder. That was a great move and very hard to find. This is the only good move. This was a game-changing move, giving black a winning position. It is brilliant. Thus, a forced checkmate is possible. It is incorrect. It was a free pawn there. It is ideal. 
This avoids the queen's check. It's compelled. This keeps on until checkmate is reached. It is ideal. This moves away from the queen of checking. It is ideal. This is not the best approach. It is incorrect. This allows a forced checkmate. It is a mistake. Giveaway one player was winning, but then gave it away. That game was pretty competitive. White played a bit better than black in the opening. Black better navigated a chaotic middle game. This forces an eventual checkmate. It is excellent. Giveaway one player was winning, but then gave it away. That game was pretty competitive. White played a bit better than black in the opening. Black better navigated a chaotic middle game.